So we're going to prove this theorem. At least we're going to explain it. We're going to explain why it is the case that the solution space to this operator equation is a d-dimensional subspace provided both a0 and ad are non-zero. And furthermore, a basis can be formed by taking functions of the form ni r to the n, where r not zero is a root of the associated polynomial, and the value of i is somewhere non-zero but less than m. Question. It's certainly connected to it. it it's not linear algebra, but yeah, it isn't. But certainly connected to it. Okay.